Hi friends, it's Lindsay. Welcome back to my channel. So today would be Tutorial Thursday, but I do have a haul I want to share with you, so I'm calling today Haul Thursday um, instead. So I ordered some more stuff from Pop Up Vintage on Instagram, and I have um, mentioned that seller a few times because she really collects the most amazing vintage items and her prices are very good even with shipping it's not too bad so i just wanted to show you what i picked up this time i got some playing cards from the 1960s and um i really liked this leaf and berry pattern because to me it's very botanical and i can use it in a lot of those type of journals they have some nice aging and sh so i have five of those and then I also loved these rose ones. They have great aging, great colors, and I have five of those as well. And um, she always sends some goodies. And so she sent me a domino, a flinch card, some Halloween stickers, a Christmas napkin, a, and a doily. So I was really happy for that. And then I got these vintage linens as well. And my idea is to cover um, a journal. And I'm trying to decide, is this one Thanksgiving or autumn, guys? Or is that just too green? Is it more St. Patrick's Day? But I'm looking here. It's almost like a pumpkin and almost like a, I don't know. It's kind of Thanksgiving to me. But um, let me know what you think about what what style is this? I mean, I know it's kind of folk art, but um, does it have a genre? Does it, is it Thanksgiving or should I just do botanical or, you know, random? So I got that one because I thought it was really cute and it had some nice aging. And then this vintage doily as well, which I thought would be really nice to wrap around the front of a big journal. And um, I really was happy with the prices because this was a dollar and this was a dollar. And each of these sets were a dollar. And then I paid shipping on top of that. Um, so I thought that was a really good deal. And I'm so happy to incorporate these into my projects. So please check her out at popup underscore vintage on Instagram. And every day she comes up with new amazing things. And I always have to hold myself back and not order um, too frequently. So... I just thought I would share that with you today on Thursday, and hopefully next week we'll be right back into another tutorial. So have a wonderful day, friends.